Arlington woman says property she bought to build her $2 million dream home has been nothing but a nightmare. Bradley Blackburn shows us why she's suing the city. On three acres in Arlington, Betty Warner built an oasis 10 years ago. I like to entertain, have parties, just enjoy it. There's a crystal pool and a koi pond, but now water has become a huge headache. It sounds like the Colorado River is running through here. She says when it rains, her yard becomes a ditch, overflowing with sewage and garbage from the neighborhood. Oil floats on the top of it and some kind of filmy yucky stuff. I'm not sure what it is. Bags of trash come if it's trash day and it rains. She says her pond is full of sediment and she's lost 15 trees with more dying now. It's root rot. It's dying from too much water in the ground. Warner claims the problem started seven years ago with new development on nearby Cooper Road. Put all this concrete in. You have to displace that water. So she called the city. A gentleman came out and told me that it was always their intention to run all the water downhill into this property. She says the city claimed there was an agreement with a previous landowner in the 70s, but she was never made aware of it. I asked him, why did you let me put a $2 million home here? And he said, it's not our business to tell you what to do with your property. Warner is now suing Arlington. A city spokesperson said they can't comment on the suit because they haven't received it yet, but they said they haven't changed drainage in the area. I feel like they don't care. She worries about the stability of her home and wants Arlington to stop the drainage and pay her back for a half million dollars spent trying to fix the problem. And I don't know what to do to stop them, to make them fix it and make it right. Hoping for peace of mind in what was supposed to be a dream house. Bradley Blackburn, Channel 8 News. Beginning.